Will you guys come help me for a minute here? I need your help because, well, I need you, and I need you to be the storm. What I have here are two houses, all right? I have two houses that look a lot alike. And in here, I have a bunch of sand, sand, sand. And in here, I have rocks. What we're gonna do is decide what happens when the storm comes. They look a lot alike, don't they, boys and girls? And you know what? Sometimes we think we're like other people and we compare ourselves to others and we say, I'm not that bad or I'm better than that person. But boys and girls, that's not what Jesus is talking about. He's talking about what is your foundation? So what I'd like to do is hold these up. This is our house in the sand. This is our house on the rock. And may the storms come. Go ahead, bring the storm on. Let's see what happens to our two houses. Whoa, whoa, awesome. Uh-oh, look what's happening. Stop the storm, stop the storm. Oh, boys and girls. Whoa. Uh-oh, what just happened to our house that on the sand? Cool. It's gone, it's demolished, but the house on the rock, it stands. Boys and girls, I want to explain this to you in just one more way. The house on the rock is built on God's Word, the Bible. What are you building your life on? Are you building it on the Bible? Or are you building it? Let's do this. It stands. Or boys and girls, are you building your life? Can you help me, Miss Manny? Can. On friends and TV and social media, and what the world tells you. Boys and girls, to build your life on the rock is to know what the Bible says, to understand that Jesus loves you and his plans for you are good. And you know what? Sometimes we don't like it. Sometimes we want to build our life on what the world says and our friends and social media and that everything's okay. But we got to trust that God's word is what gives us the promises and the hope and the very best for our life, even though sometimes we have a hard time. That's why we have each other, so that we can pray for each other, so we can tell each other what we're struggling with, and we can take it back to the rock, who is Jesus. 